Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingphase.com. Today we got a new topic. Sky is the limit for web development. Your body and your mind. Uh, since I dropped the video on uh, how to make $135,000 with HTML, uh, people have been going crazy. People pulling their ears, and the people pulling their hairs, people pulling their noses out. People is like, oh my god, I'm about to pop my eye out. Right? <laughs> they freaking out right now. So, what's happening is that people that are here don't understand that things are happening up here. Right? So, think about it like this. Life and relationships and the places where you go to are circles. Okay? So, if you are in a circle of you work at, as a mechanic. I always bring this up. You're a mechanic at Pet Boys, right? And you're online looking for your next career. And then you see somebody say, hey man, you could earn $135,000 a year doing just HTML emails. Automatically in your head, you're like, man, I'm working so hard at Pet Boys for $35,000 a year. How the hell is somebody gonna make $135,000 with the basics of web development? There's no way. This is not possible. But what you don't understand is that this person is at the bottom. His circle is Lil Cindy, the retail girl, Lil Johnny, the dental assistant, Billy, who works across the street. He works at the local deli. Lil Sam, who works at a uh, freaking stopping shop. You get what I'm saying? That's his circle. You know, what's happening up here in this other circle where you have professionals, guys with careers, guys who know what the hell's going on in companies, you know, those guys are making 80, 100, 130, $140,000, $160,000 a year easily, right? But that's because that's the type of circles that they are around, right? They know how to find those jobs. They know how to train themselves to get those jobs. They know how to uh, do networking. You get what I'm saying? It's like right now. Right now, I could say I'm in a 200,000 circle, right? I'm in that 200,000 circle. I know a, a couple of guys that make that much. And I make myself around there, you know, like 170, 180, right? Hopefully this year I beat my mark of 200. So I'm in that circle, right? So everything that I'm, I come here and give you guys is from what I'm seeing. And from what I know can happen too, right? I cannot come here and tell you guys, guys, there's no way nobody earns $500 million a year because I'm down here. You get what I'm saying? What happens up there for 500, you know, after 10 million, 50 million, 100 million, $500 million a year, right? I have no reason to even be giving an opinion on it. You get what I'm saying? Because I'm down here. I'm barely at 200. You get what I'm saying? Like this is my circle. This is my inner circle, right? So this is what I'm doing. This is what I tell you guys, man. You have to understand that everything is possible. Sky's the limit. And only way that you're gonna get there is by having the knowledge and the information from you know from online, even this website codingphase.com, and understanding how things work in the world. Uh, I, I went and created the passive income course, right? Uh, somebody went and left a a crazy a, a crazy comment on it it was like I wanted to learn how to make money with react but the guy spent five videos explaining how advertising works do you get what I'm saying this is the type of mentality that people have out there how are you gonna make money with react if you don't understand what are the type of avenues that you're gonna make money with what type of streams is gonna come to you you need advertising. So you, for you to make money with advertising, you need to learn how advertising work. You know, you need to learn how to work with keywords, AdSense, AdWords, like you need those things. But this is the type of mentality that people have. You know, when you hear stuff like that online, and I always tell you guys, you gotta be careful when you look at comments. Most of the people that are really smart don't even comment. It's rarely that I comment on a video, even when I like the video, rarely. You know, the people that usually comment are the trolls or the super fans, guys who are, you know, very supportive of the person, or those are the, the you know, the type of uh, people that you're gonna find. It's 
the whole spectrum, right? This a whole middle section. There's the guys that love you and the people that just hate you, right? So when you look at comments, you gotta think about it like this. There's not a middle ground. There's not somebody who's like, oh, I like this guy's content, or hey, I respect what he's saying, or hey, this is knowledgeable. No, there's the people that love it, and then there's the people that just automatically hate it. You see a comment there that says, hey, this is fake, this is not real, this is this is and that. You gotta understand, there is no middle ground. Now, like I said, sky is the limit to what you can do, you know? Once again, I'll bring this up because this is one of the most ridiculous things that I've, I've heard. I'm like, I don't even know how people could follow this person. This person said, you cap out at $65,000 when you are a WordPress developer. Not understanding that WordPress is just a skill, right? I know guys that make up to $400,000 with WordPress, right? One of the guys that work at Universal Music Group, most of the websites from every artist that you see out there is made with WordPress. They're not building that shit. We're not using Laravel. They're not going in, hey guys, go get Node.js. No, they do this straight WordPress. Who you think makes that? A WordPress developer, you get what I'm saying? So now you have situations where, you know, there's a guy who works at a digital agency, a local digital agency uh, around the corner and his job is to just create little simple themes and for the local uh, companies around there. Yeah, he's gonna get stuck doing $65,000 a year. But if he's smart, he don't stay stuck there. He said, okay, cool, I got my experience. I learned how to use WordPress. I know how to build my own themes, my own plugins. Let me move up, start working with a major company. Now the guy's making $90,000, $100,000 a year. Now if he's really smart and somebody like me that has the you know, entrepreneurial uh, bug in, in his ear where you go like, hey, cool, I could work for this company. I could make my money here. But you know what? There's other avenues too. I can start selling themes online, make $50,000, $60,000 a year, extra above my $100,000 I'm making for my company for something that I could do on the weekend. Now the guy says, damn, I made $60,000 just from creating themes. Let me build some plugins now. Right? The guy goes, builds plugins. Now he makes another $50,000. So from that level of where he was at, at $60,000, now he's looking at $200,000 plus. And sky's the limit. If he really becomes popular with themes and he really dropping in a lot of content, he really busts his ass, hey, now he could unplug from the matrix and leave his company and say, you know what? I'm going to do this full time. You get what I'm saying? I'm going to do this full time and I'm going to work 100% as a WordPress developer, creating content online and selling my work on teamforest.com or selling my work at uh, templatemonsters.com. There's so many different avenues that people can go to. Like, it's ridiculous. You get what I'm saying? This is just a skill that you have. But that skill, you got to make it into a business. You got to think of yourself as a business, right? You're the one that produced all of this content, all of this work, all of this code. You get what I'm saying? So like I said, sky is the limit. You get what I'm saying? So when you see stuff online, people try to discredit something or they'll be like, man, da da da. Guys, they're not around those circles. I cannot go to uh, Warren Buffett and tell him, hey man, you guys don't be flipping a, a billion dollars a day. You guys don't do that. I'm not around that circle. You know what I'm saying? What the hell do I know about uh, stocks and Warren Buffett and, and, and those guys? You know what I'm saying? That's like me going to uh, Elon Musk and, and telling him, man, what you mean you're getting a billion dollar loan? Stop lying. You know what I'm saying? Like, who the fuck, who the fuck I am to be talking to Elon Musk about a loan? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't have that knowledge. I don't have those skills. I'm not around those people. You know what I'm saying? They are developers out here who work in companies and have work in digital agencies and work in et cetera, right? But not everybody is on the same level that I am. I've basically gone from every single level that you could be at, from the bottom to middle companies, you know, mid-level companies to enterprise to pretty much making my own money online. Like I've done every single avenue that you could think of, right? Not a lot of the people are out here that have been through every single stage like me. Some of them might be might even be even more talented than me as developers. 
and they're in the house and they're like, man, I could code better than this guy. I can do this and that. But you know what I do that's better than even guys who are way better developers than me? I actually know how to work. I actually know how to make money. I actually know how to be a business. I'm not just a developer. You get what I'm saying? Like everything that I learn, I know how to multiply by 10. You know what I'm saying? You put me at any company, from that company somehow, I help them out with the marketing. I help them out with, you know, the type of designs that they need to do. I help them out with web development. You know what I'm saying? Like, I help them out which ones are the best frameworks, which ones are the best avenues that we should focus on. I'm not just a regular developer. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just this one guy that does one thing that is only good at this thing. That's what you see online. Most of the guys that you see here, that's they're only good for one thing. They're good for JavaScript, that's it. They're good for PHP, that's it. I've done every single type of avenue that you could think of. You know what I'm saying? So, like I bring this back up to you guys, sky is the limit. You get what I'm saying? So, when you hear people that come in and just be like, man, this is not possible. There's no way that people do this. Guys, people do it all the time, man. And I want you guys to do, take it sometimes. Go through like the richest neighborhoods in your area. Right? Go through places where you know you cannot afford anything there. And ask yourself, how the hell does so many people have so much money? How the hell is it that so many people are having like million dollar house, three million dollar house, 14 million dollar houses? Like, how is that possible? And you don't know them and you don't see them. You gotta understand you're not in that circle. But for them, that's the norm. You know, $135,000 job for me is the norm. That's not the thing that I'm looking at. It's like, oh my God, I can't believe people are doing this. That's the norm. You know, when I first started, I was like, man, I'll never see that type of money. My goal was $50,000 when I first started. I said, I want to make $50,000. That's it. But as I kept growing and bumping into people who make way more money than me, they opened my eyes to what's possible. You get what I'm saying? Then I started jumping into different avenues, different circles, bumping into people who are way more accomplished than me, way more smarter than me. You get what I'm saying? So... Like I said, sky is the limit. So don't listen to what people say out there, man. And understand who's bullshitting and who's not bullshitting. Who are the people that come in and give you good advice? And people who are just like, hey, I thought of something today. I'm going to talk about this today. Like, there's people that do no research. You get what I'm saying? Like, I come in and give you the, the freaking details. You know, when people were saying here the other day, like, man, there's no way there's more Ruby or Rails jobs than Python. I came in and give you the details. You know what I mean? There's no way there's HTML email jobs that are making that much money. I came in and show you all of my emails. That's the regular. You get what I'm saying? So I come in and show you what's possible and understand that. You get what I'm saying? So anyways, this is your boy Joe, back at it again, codingface.com. Your boy's back and I done did it again. Please guys, go through my description, click on the link star there, that's the best way to support me. If you're gonna buy a course on Udemy, or you decide to, hey, you wanna come and learn from me, come do it through the description. That's the best way that you can support your boy Joe. It's your boy. This video is brought to you by codingface.com and all of its members. Make sure you go visit a website. It's the only place where you're gonna learn how to become a web developer with real projects. Take it from me, it's your boy Joe, back at it again, codingface.com. Keep it real, keep it trill.